What's up everybody, hope you're having a good day Welcome to another video of Call of Duty Mobile And this is the brand new update for Season 9 I am looking forward to this mode The, uh, the graphics have been upgraded to Really a phenomenal, really looking swanky graphics You know, So I'm looking at it, I'm loving it And I'm, yeah, everybody's been talking about this Gunsmith, Gunsmith, Gunsmith Now I play this game on the PC version Modern Warfare as well So I'm a little bit more familiar with Gunsmith um, the attachments are a bit different But uh, generally, I will tell you that Gunsmith is all about being familiar, being comfortable So you choose attachments that make you comfortable with it And I, my recommendation is to not keep changing your attachments Because they affect the way you play Now, keep to attachment um, There's a reason why they choose 10 loadouts now Okay um, different attachments would affect your gun differently One point, point to note before I go on Legendary is not affected So no matter what attachments you choose Other than the grips It will not affect your legendary guns For example, you can see my K, KN44 color spectrum it Does not affect the gun at all So other than the grips Yeah, okay, let's so take a look at that Alright, so like I was saying Attachments affect your gameplay So try not to change it too much That's the reason why you have 10 loadouts Make sure you use your loadouts carefully Plant it according to the maps Now, for example, if you're going for a long range gun Okay, a long range map in fact uh, Maybe firing range You need something that has lower recoil but higher damage rate For longer ranges, for example For MP5s, SMGs they are used for close quarters, right? So you want something that has quick ADS But that means you need to sacrifice something on a recoil uh, Recoil control And uh, maybe a bit of damage range So these are things that you need to look out for When you're choosing your attachments Like I said, don't switch them out too much um, Because they affect your gameplay And um, it is no longer the old, you know, COD Mobile these attachments work for this gun, that kind of thing. No, it's all about comfort zone, guys. All right, so one more thing to note um, the guns are all resetted. I think a lot of people and guys, you know, you already know this. So um, you got to upgrade your guns again to enjoy the, uh, the, the full uh, capabilities of your gun, right? Okay, uh, example I'm going to show you is my LK24. Right now, um, I'm just going to go through the whole process of upgrading and putting in the, the, the attachments Okay, let's go ahead and choose my LK24, my favorite gun There we go Okay, you can see Gunsmith, I need to level them up all the way to the maximum This is something that's going to be really expensive for everybody So make sure you choose the guns that you want properly You know, otherwise it's going to be an expensive process So, uh, yeah so you can take a look, um, the gunsmiths allow you, the blueprints I mean, allow you to choose the different skins that you have uh, Right now there are no charms, stickers available, so I'm sure they'll be coming up with that soon to earn more money <laughs> Alright, so there we go, this is the whole process from uh, upgrading the gun So from then on, it's all about choosing the right attachments for the gun Alright, they are a variety of different attachments, make sure you choose the correct one according to your gameplay and game style My suggestion, like I said before, is to go with one that works well with the map Okay, yeah, works well with the map uh, There are 10 loadouts, so plan your loadouts properly uh, to, to fit the map, in fact, and gameplay And your personal gameplay So that, that's, my, that's my take on this Yeah, and uh, don't change it too much yeah, Like I said, you know There are different perks, you know, so Go for what's most comfortable for you That's, that's my advice to everybody who's watching this video uh, Yeah, so There are counterbalances to each decision that you make If you go for long range barrels, for example It means that you sacrifice um, recoil control Or you sacrifice ADS Personally, I like ADS, but that means for longer range, I have to take a minus point. You know, I will, which I will, which I will elaborate further in my um, in the video, in my gameplay uh, later on. Otherwise, yeah, 
you know take time it's it's quite a lot to take in i understand this new update is huge and it's going to be a ton of questions raised about this okay so i'm going to show you this gameplay for example you see my ads is quick because of my attachments but my range is terrible look at the jump on that it is terrible the jump is the recoil jump is, is so much that's because of my attachments right in the past we didn't have that it was just really simple you know with a grip or with a scope that kind of thing yeah if you're into that kind of thing so that's that's the thing about let's take away from this one more point to note I, I haven't played the full features of the game yet but one more time point to note is uh, UAVs they no longer display real-time imaging of your position right it's it follows the console methods of um, of uh, you, you know you have to predict the motion and uh, one more thing domination right uh, so it, it's also following the console versions as well so you need to clear off the rings before it, it, yeah you no longer you know the moment you lose the point you need to clean it off it no longer works the same as before right so uh leave your comments below there's so much to talk about and i hope to see you soon thank you for watching bye